all right so welcome back to the channel guys so today guys i want to do a uh, fifa world cup qualification so let's go look at the qualifying formats i believe all the confederations have finally revealed their format so we're going to do a video just going through all now i might have already done a video on certain regions i, I think i already did it for afc and uefa i uh, will go over them again very briefly we're not going to go too much into depth because like i said guys we've already gone over so for Africa and CONCACAF, I really want to talk about those because we didn't really get to talk about it. So, you know, there's also OFC as well. They haven't revealed their format yet. I'll probably just do a separate video for them because who knows when they're going to do their format, you know? Anyways, let's go ahead and get started with this video. So let's start with AFC first since it's here. And let me make this screen a little bigger for you guys. I'll also leave a link in the description below. So I'm using the, literally the Wikipedia website. So first round, 22 teams ranked 26 to 47 will play home and away over two legs. Okay, this is basically like, you know, the preliminary round, okay? 11 winners advance to the second round. 20, 36 teams, those ranked 1 to 25, and the 11 first round winners are divided into 9 groups of 4 to play home and away round robin matches. The 18 group winners and group winners up advance to the third round. The 18 teams that advance to the second round are divided into 3 groups of 6 to play home and away round match round robin matches. The top 2 teams of each group qualify for the World Cup, while the 3rd and 4th place teams of each group advance to the 4th round. The six teams that advance from the third round are divided into two groups of three teams, each to play a single round robin. The winners qualify for the World Cup. The group runners up in the previous round will compete in a playoff tie to determine the Asian representation at the Inter Confederation playoffs. So basically, you have like two group stages, essentially, if you want to qualify directly. And if you get like third and fourth, um, you know, you're going to basically have, um, you know, have like another group stage, essentially. And the top two teams from that, from there, you know, will do it so it's it's, it's kind of complicated but um i think i could show you guys a little graphic they put a, gr a graphic on the website so i think it's a lot more easier than you know me just saying it so as you guys can see i think this is pretty straightforward then um as you guys can see group stage here pretty straightforward and then another group stage and then basically another group stage again for the teams that came third and fourth respectively so i think it's a lot more easier when you have the graphic rather than a you know just straight up words uh, at least to me it is okay now, Africa. Africa has announced their format. So let's go ahead and look into the main article. I think it'll be a lot better we look at this way rather than, you know, reading from the thing there. So let's go and look at this. So um, they announced a new qualification. Teams will be drawn into nine groups of six teams. The winners of each group will directly qualify for the World Cup, while the four best group winners ups will play in a playoffs to determine which teams will advance the Interconfederation playoffs. Yeah, so basically we're going to have nine groups of six teams, basically. So as you guys can see, this will be interesting. I think it's going to be home and away matches. And then they'll rank the runners-up. And the four best runners-up teams will go to, like, the semifinals. And then they'll do, like, a, they're going to have basically, like, a tournament, essentially. And I, I think these are one-off games. Yeah, these are one-off games, I'm pretty sure. So, like I said, I, particularly for the Africa, I think Asia format is good. I like the Asia format. The Africa format, in my opinion, I it's, it's very similar to the UEFA format, where basically they had all the, you know, all the nations compete in it, and the group winners directly advance. And obviously, second place teams had to go to a playoffs. Except this time, it's not going to be all second place teams. It's going to be four. I don't really like the four second place teams. I think that's really, really unfair. I don't really like that idea in particular. But you know, I am okay with group winners. This is a much better format than the whole like two legged playoff tie. I despise that. I think that was really unfair. So, and if you were to ask me if this is better than that, of course it is. Uh, but I don't think this is the best. That's just my general opinion. So you guys may disagree with me, but yeah. Okay, now let's go look up a CONCACAF. This is my confederation, of course. You know, I'm a American, so let's go look into this right here. So let's go ahead and look into this. So CONCACAF. Okay, first round. Four CONCACAF teams ranked 29 and 32 based on the FIFA ranks in the 2023 will be divided into two matches, played on a two-legged home and away basis. The two winners advance the second round. So basically another preliminary round, except only four teams are involved. 30 teams, the two winners in the pre um, two winners from the first round, CONCACAF teams ranked 1 to 28. Based on the FIFA rankings in November 2023, will be drawn into six groups of five teams. They'll play a single round robin matches, two home and two away, group, group, group winners and runners up qualifying for the third round. And the 12 teams advancing for the second round will be drawn into three groups of four teams. They will play double round robin home and away matches that with the three group winners qualify for the World Cup. The two best ranked runners up will advance the interconfederation playoffs. Okay, this format is stupid. I I don't understand. Why is it single games? Okay, let me actually look at the graphic here if it makes any sense. Okay, so schedule. So, yeah, it's going to be single games. Yes, yeah, single game. What? I don't understand CONCACAF. Why, man? Why? Why did you have to do this kind of crap format? Okay, then you advance to the third round. 
when then you have okay and they, these are like double round what I I I don't get it man it just is so weird it doesn't make sense oh jeez yeah I'm sorry this format is I don't like this I despise this format I I I really don't know what Concrete was thinking yeah this is a terrible format so yeah I mean this is not great. Okay, let's go look at the um, let's go look at the last one which we have is Condomo. Now Condomo is straightforward. I mean, basically everyone plays round robin. Um, you know, very very straightforward. Everyone knows this. This is the probably the most fairest way. Basically, everyone plays each other home and away. And obviously, um, Ecuador has been deducted minus three for the whole um, Chile situation last World Cup. You know, Brian Castillo. So, yeah, like I said, very straightforward. The top six directly qualify. Seventh gets the care fair ship playoffs. Probably the most simple. Probably the best of the bunch. So yeah, I like this one. And now UEFA. OFC haven't done their format yet, so um, we'll look into theirs. I, I don't know when to... Yeah, I don't even know when they're going to do theirs. They're going to probably do theirs sometime soon. Okay. So basically, the UEFA format is pretty much going to be like the last edition, except this time we're going to have like 12 groups. We're going to have 12 groups where I believe we had like 10 groups, if I'm not mistaken. I think we had like 10 groups. And so basically, we're going to have like either four or five teams, and then, you know, everyone plays round robin. And yeah, basically, that's how it works, you know. Um, so as you guys can see, this is how it's going to work. So we're going to have, like, basically, you know, round robin and group winners advance, basically. Like, group winners will be advanced directly. So, you know, at least UEFA and um, Africa is straightforward. Asia is good. It's a bit comp. I, I think Asia is a bit too long. And CONCACAF is by far the worst. I hate CONCACAF format. I don't know what CONCACAF was thinking. Okay, anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Um, let me know what you guys thought of the qualifiers for each respective confederation. Tell me which one's the best. Tell me which one's the worst. And yeah, like I said, guys, I hope you guys did enjoy. So, guys, if you like this video, if you did enjoy, subscribe if you're new on here. Comment below your thoughts, comment section below. Consider becoming a member of the channel. I did remove the star players. There's only one membership level now. So, you know, feel free to consider becoming a member. All right, see you guys later. Peace out.